think about how I hurt you, Kyle and Isaac. So ashamed of myself. I know that we can't get back to where we were. But maybe we can find it in another way. Start again from a new place. Without denying the effect it had on us. Are you serious? I heard you. At the hospital just after the hit and run when you thought I was asleep. I think you were hallucinating. You said that you don't know what you'd have done if you'd lost me. Maybe that's because of the boys. You sounded like you were almost crying. You were at death's door. Yeah, but you cared. When I thought you hated me. I mean, it, it meant so much. It gave me hope. Look, I know how much I have hurt you. Well, I let you in. I won't be making that mistake again. I never stopped loving you. You never stopped loving me. You, you, you say that like, like, it, like it makes it better. Maybe I just don't think I deserve to be happy, I don't know. No, please. Oh, we, we all deal with things in different ways. You disappeared after Joe. You shut me out completely. What, you're dragging that up again? No, but it's linked. We were dealing with so much at the time that we we're unable to share anymore. Look, I don't want to keep going over the past. We always end up here, fronting it out that we're nothing to each other. Who says it's a front? Kane, I can't stand being without you. And the, the thought of being like this for the rest of my life, it terrifies me. And I will do anything, anything if you just give me another chance, please. Because I really... Really love you. Look me in the eye and tell me that you don't love me. Then say something. Like what? Like you don't want a divorce either? Because once we sign it, that's it final. We can't go back. Yep. Yeah. What does that mean? I know this is uncomfortable for you, but, but it's good that we're talking, properly talking. Me more than you. And it was my fault that we didn't before because I kept pushing you away, which was the opposite of what I really wanted. Baby steps. It won't happen in an instant, but I will give it everything, I promise you that. And done with talking. We destroyed our marriage. And no matter of excuses can change that. You know, I... I trusted you and... You broke my heart. Oh, I'm sorry if I caused you even more pain. I will leave you alone now. Put the farm on the market. What? Well, I, I, I can't live here if there's no hope for us. But you can't just decide. I mean, let, let, let things settle between us first. It'll be better like this. Don't worry, I won't move too far away. You'll still be able to see Isaac whenever you want. It'll be better for who? Look, for Kyle, you can't, you can't split him and Isaac up. It's working well as it is. Suppose you meet someone else. I won't be able to handle that, Kane. And I've put my kids through enough. They need me to have a fighting chance. So you... You're putting the farm on the market? Was it Matty's home? And what about Rona's share? I'll sort out all those details. I've made my decision. And I've faced up to what you've been trying to tell me, which... It's that we're over. And I've lost you. A bit calmer, are we? It was you. I was driving by, saw your van, heard you both planning on doing something very nasty to Jamie. Couldn't have that. You had no right. And you're over-invested. He's your ex. Let him hang himself. 